This is Marcus. He's terrible at time management. He can't find anything on that cluttered desk. Not having anything in order means Marcus can't stay focused. Oh no, he's falling asleep. Oh my gosh, who are you? I'm the time management fairy. And first things first, we need to get this desk in order. Whoa, thanks time management fairy. Marcus has tons of homework to do. If he had a fixed commitment plan like an agenda or calendars, he'd know what his priorities were. Marcus, have you done all your homework today? No, nah, I was going to do my homework after watching TV. I don't think that's going to cut it. No, nah, but the game is on. You need a fixed commitment plan. A fixed commitment plan? What's a fixed commitment plan? Ah! Whoa! Thanks, Time Management Fairy. <laughs> Like someone needs to set some goals. What's wrong, Marcus? Holy smokes, time management. I can't seem to stay focused one bit. I think you need to create a goals list, Marcus. What's a goals list? It's a list of goals. Ah. Uh, that's a great idea. Ah! Wow, time management fairy, these are some great goals. This will definitely keep me on track. <laughs> Studying in a loud, noisy environment, there's no way to get things done. Wow, that sounds swell. Thanks, Time Management Fairy. <laughs> Even when you think you have nothing to do, exercise is the best way to keep your brain in shape. You need to get some exercise. But I did all my homework. You need to get some exercise. It's good for your heart, and it's good for your brain. Ah! Do you have to yell like that every time you do that? No, but you didn't ask me not to. True. See? Exercise is fun, Marcus. Gee willikers. Thanks, Time Lynch, my fairy. <laughs> ah! You have to scream like that 